What's up everybody? So apparently there is a um, gameplay trailer that shows off some features of the game and stuff for this uh, Fantasian game, the, the new Sakaguchi game coming out from Mist Walker. I'm excited about the game. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to it. I just hope that it comes to consoles. So I'm going to check this out. Uh, many of you all suggested this to me, so let's, uh, let's check it out. I'll give my kind of thoughts on it. I knew about the dioramas. Uh, that's really cool. I like that a lot. They actually built these dioramas. Physically. That's awesome. Uh, I love the way that looks. The music's cool too. Monsters will come up with a for their ultimate dimension. That's interesting. And there's a counter up there. Okay, so that's how many random battles you've sent to that dimension. That's cool. Oh, and it hits like a critical level. It starts turning colors. Okay, yeah. Then through dimension battle, you can purge all monsters from the dimension at once. That's awesome! That's really cool. I like that. I would think though that you'd have to have your levels up a little bit before you try to do something like with a bunch of monsters. Because you can get wrecked doing that too. This looks really cool. I like the UI too. I like the way the UI looks. It's got very, very classic JRPG feel to it. Which I love. Love. You all know. Turn based, boss battles, strategy. This is Pat out of potions. Big attacks. Seems like they give dialogue updates to whatever's going on, like, okay, we're out of potions, you don't have any in your inventory, that's cool. That's cool. Alright, hey, you know what? This looks fantastic. This looks fantastic, but that's the only thing right there. Only on Apple Arcade. Um... But that doesn't mean that it can't come to PS4 or something like that. So I think we could see this on PS4, PS5, uh, Xbox Game Pass, or something like that, right? I I, I think there will be an exclusivity to it. This, just the way this game looks and as hyped as people are for it, I don't see it only being on Apple Play. now. I read a little excerpt from an interview with Sakaguchi where he said that a year or a couple years ago him and his team played Final Fantasy VI again and that this was inspired by that playthrough which gives me a lot of hope. Gives me a lot of hope because Final Fantasy VI is one of the greatest JRPGs ever made. It is incredible. That is an incredible video game. So if this is some kind of spiritual successor to that. Not, obviously not in graphics, right? But in gameplay, story, or something like that. Or just the, the spirit of the game. This is going to be a great game. But, and I've seen, I've seen a lot of you all talking about how I was like down on the Apple Arcade thing. Look, here's the thing. This is why I'm down on it. I want everybody, everybody should have a chance to play this game, right? If you have a Google device or something that's not an Apple device as your mobile phone or whatever uh, then you're not gonna be playing it now you can you can do blue stacks or something all day you know but it's just not it's not the same you know as, as playing it like on a console or something like that so I think this is gonna be a really good game I'm excited for it but I hope that 
I hope it gets the presence and the release and the eyes on it and people playing it that it deserves because this is a great team working on this game. Miss Walker Studios is a great studio, right? Uh, Lost Odyssey was an incredible, incredible slept on game by a lot of people. Lost Odyssey was one of the best RPGs of that generation. I, I still champion that. It had excellent music, great characters, excellent artwork, fantastic story. Lost Odyssey was excellent, and people just never played it. I don't want what happened to Lost Odyssey to happen to this game. That that's that's my point. I feel like Sakaguchi, and yeah, I get it that mobile phone games and stuff are really popular in Japan, and that's that's the thing, right? And it's not so much like that so far in the West or whatever, but. I feel like he's a great creator who doesn't make the best business decisions all the time. That's that's not meant to be a hot take or anything like that. That's just my what I've seen. That's just what I've seen. Um, he understands the gaming business and industry, but like a move like this, I, I feel like this like okay. I feel like the release could be handled better. That's all. That's all I'm gonna say about it. The game looks fantastic. All that other stuff aside, the game looks fantastic. I just hope everybody gets a chance to play it. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying about it. But I think uh, I think they've got a hit on their hands. I really do. I think this is going to be a big, big deal. I can't wait to hear the rest of the music from the game. I really, that's what I'm excited for. I want to hear the rest of the music from the game. I want to see some more, I'd like to see some concept art from the game. That's what I'd really like to see. Uh, because graphics wise... I'm not, I'm not going to lie. Graphics wise, it looks like a bridge between PS3 and PS4. It looks like a bridge between the PS3 and PS4. The dioramas look great. But as far as the character designs and stuff, it looks like something I could have played on my PS3. Um, but that's not what I judge stuff by. It, that's just what I, when I first saw it, my knee jerk reaction was this is like a PS3 game. But I'm sure it will be an excellent game. It will be an excellent PS3 to PS4 game, right? It, does, it looks like a game that maybe probably should have came out in 2012, but it's coming out in 2021, so we'll see how it looks when we're playing it, full resolution, all that kind of stuff. If it comes to console, like I said, I won't be playing it on Apple devices or Bluestacks. I, I, I don't play games like that. I'm not going to play it like that. But what do you all think? Leave your comments below. Let me know what you all think. This looks great. The, the Dimension concept is awesome looking. I love the concept of, I love that concept. I think that's a, that's a real showpiece for the game. So, well, let me know what you all think. Y'all have a great day. Keep rocking. Be good to each other. Stay safe out there. And I will see you all in the next video.